Today, we're going to look at how to publish drawings as PDF files. PDF is a universally recognised, reliable and trusted format which can be viewed on virtually any platform. When converted to PDF, objects or pages are ready for screen-ready distribution or professional high-res printing. Publishing as PDF is a similar process to exporting, in the sense that the generated file can be shared freely, independent of the original Draw Plus DPP file, and consequently used in various environments once it's published. So let's get started. To demonstrate publishing as PDF, I'm going to use a Draw Plus sample called Dressmakers. The sample designs are available from the Startup Wizard. Just click Sample Designs on the left. Feel free to open the design and follow along with this tutorial if you want to. This design is an A3 poster. Now, I'd like to publish it as a high resolution PDF, so I can send it to my printers for printing. To begin, I'll open the File menu and choose Publish as PDF. This is the Publish PDF dialog. A preview of your PDF file will appear here. At the top, you can choose a profile. Each profile gathers together the typical settings needed to meet specific publishing needs. I want to publish in high resolution output, so I'm going to choose the PDFX 1A profile. This will include page marks and bleed, which will assist the printers in printing my design. This profile also sets a high quality 300 dpi resolution for a professional and polished finish. Alternatively, if you wanted a screen ready PDF, i.e., to upload to websites, you could choose the Web Compact profile. Here, images are downsampled, which helps produce a smaller file size and quicker loading from web pages. When you've chosen your profile, Draw Plus will automatically set the compatibility so you don't have to worry about this setting. The automatically checked options will also change depending on what profile you've selected. In the dialog, you can also adjust the range and specify the pages which are to be included in the PDF file if your project has more than one page. You could also adjust the scale if you need to. More advanced PDF options are available by clicking this arrow at the bottom of the dialog. If you need more information about any of the PDF settings or profiles, you can click the Dialog's Help button at any time. When you're happy with the settings, you can proceed with publishing your PDF file. To do this, first click OK. Now, you'll need to choose somewhere to save your PDF file and also give it a name. Well that's all for this tutorial. For more information, see the Help, the How To tab or the other online tutorials. Thanks for watching.